Hey, it's the FM Gaffer here, and welcome to episode 4 of Improving Irish Football. Now, since you last joined me, not a lot has happened before. No national team pictures, only the two in the, um, well, not even two in the league, one in the league and one in the FA Cup quarterfinal. Um, so yeah, during that time, um, obviously, after the loss of uh, loss to Limerick in that quarterfinal, we the board came to us and said we had to win our next game or well that's what the conversation resulted in having to win our next game to stay in the job luckily i did um but yeah i'm just letting you know that i might be a little bit my job at security wasn't as good as i thought it was if you look at it it's the ma majority of wins it's just uh, they were like oh that's a poor result and we only lost two nil to limerick who were i mean they're like a mid-table team it's not that bad but anyway, so yeah, we lost to Limerick in the quarterfinals, so unfortunately we're out of the FIA Cup. Uh, Dean Clark and Ian Turner with the uh, two goals either side of half time. Um, but then, yeah, we beat today's opponents in the EA Sports Cup final. We beat them in the league away from home 3 0. And we are actually playing this away at Dundalk. Uh, we're playing at Dundalk's home stadium in the cup final, which I think is a bit biased. Oriel Park, I think it's called. Yeah, it's Oriel Park. Um, so yeah, li on this occasion, Liam Kelly gave us the lead, and then two late goals from Marty Waters and Graham Burke sealed it. So, that's all, all that's been happening beforehand uh, Good home. So yeah, today we've got the uh, EA Sports Cup final between us and Dundalk. So, let's get right into it. I don't see anything else I need to particularly say. I mean, it's a very short gap between the last episode. Um, but yeah, I def definitely wanted to see this. This could be our first cut win in this save. Um, so yeah, I just quick pick to there and I'll make any changes I need. Definitely want to keep with those front four. They're pretty much my top front four. Uh, Robbie Crawford. I think I'm going to bring in... I'm going to bring in Brandon Mille. He's been good for me in the cup competitions. I've been bringing him in for that. Although he's tired. Uh, no, no, I'll swap them back. I was wondering why he wasn't on the bench. Where is he? There he is. Um, just looking at the bench. Who I don't really want to bring on. To be fair, the assistants done a pretty good job. I think I'm just going to go with the team. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty much my best eleven. These picks. So yeah, Patrick Almond is top scorer by uh, one from Pad Padraig Cunningham. <laughs> you know, but yeah, Michael O'Connor is the only other one that can score goals in this competition. So yeah, for Dundalk. So as long as we keep him from scoring those goals we should have the top score in the competition and hopefully we'll have the cup at the end of the day as well uh, winning the air sports cup would undoubtedly be a pinnacle of shamrock rovers campaign just how badly do you and your team want it uh it'll be in a mirror of any whole team work yeah so dundalk of uh, dundalk are obviously ahead of us they're second in the league but we did just beat them so hopefully that's a psychological edge um these fans have been fantastic. They have been the ones that really pay your wages. And Barry Murphy, M Murphy, Murphy looks to um, gain confidence. So yeah, here we go. Cup final. Ugh. Hopefully we can um, pick up our first cup victory. Keith Fahey now. Trennan is he offside? Yeah, he's offside. I did see it. He did look. His dot looked a little bit um, further forward than the rest. But yeah, it was a good, good early signs. Keith Farhi whipping in a nice rookie. Ah, arguments could be made that he was level, but no, I think he was just off, and it was a good header in. Um, so yeah, not a, just uh, yeah, I lost my thought. Anywho, um, yeah, so Patrick on picking up a yellow card. We've got another opportunity here. Hopefully, Graham Burke whips it in. I wonder. I don't know what happened there, <laughs> but yeah, O'Connor's coming away with it now. Danger on the break, perhaps. Ronan Finn, who is a former Shamrock Warriors player. Kelly George, they've gone ahead. Paul George with it, their fifth goal, his fifth goal of the season. Ah, it's disappointing. It looked like we've been on top from the two opportunities that we had. Well, we scored one of them, but you know. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to pause it. Right on 30 minutes and demand more. So yeah, his damn pots now. Kelly, don't lose it there. That's where we've got. I think even retained possession is that instruction it is. So how? Why do we keep losing it? 
Connor Kenner. Looking for Mikey Drennan, he's got a lot of space. Whip it in. Amon! Comes back to Drennan. Amon! Equalises it up. Podrick and Amon with his fifth goal of the tournament, his 11th goal of the season. Good finish there from a tight angle. And we are back level, deservedly, I would say. Um, yeah, after the first thing was cleared, Mikey Drennan played a lovely little through ball. He definitely was on side that time I was watching. And yeah, he swept it past the goalkeeper. Podrick, Amon. Another chance here, Keith Fahey, Drennan! Ooh, wanted a repeat of the goal that was disallowed, except hopefully it won't be disallowed. Corner though, Madden. Burke, is it the post, is it? Wow, great shot from there from Burke and O'Connor. And now they're breaking, but he's giving away to Mikey Drennan, and that's the end of the highlight. So I'd say we're definitely on top, but they are getting some dangerous counters, and, and it looks like it's going to be half time. Uh, one all. So yeah, it is half time. Um, today is all about sports. Yeah, I'll say the fans have been fantastic. I'd just say the same as I did before. No particularly good reactions, disappointingly. But yeah, um, it's not too bad. Uh, Mikey Drennan now. And that is, he's off. He's surely got to be off. Ube Zuono is going to be red carded with a second yellow card. Carlton Ube Zuono um, is off. And this should give us the key edge. I'm thinking I'll go up to standard. Oh, I have been, I've switched back to the counter attack. I don't even know if I ever went through my tactic with you guys. But yeah, it's 4 2 3 1. Um, complete forward. Oh my god. Robbie Crawford's fouled. Ronan Finn. And it is a penalty to the dog. So Donald steps up and smashes their home. And it is 2 1. Well, that's kind of disappointing. Um, O'Donnell. <sighs> yeah, it was a good finish in the end. Um, but yeah, I think we've got to go. Well, not attacking, but maybe attacking. Oh, if it hasn't, we on and highlight. No, yeah, I'm gonna go switch to attacking. Um, make some subs. What can I do? I'll bring on Gavin Brennan for Burke. I'll bring on Keen Kavanagh for Podrick Amond, and I can swap him with. Liam Kelly, that's all I'll do for now, just in case I might go into extra time. Come on, guys. Oh, how can we concede with 10 men? Oh, I'm gonna go overload the minute. Ah, oh, charts, come on, please score here. King Kavanagh, Madden, Fahi, Crawford finds Madden, Drennan, Kavanagh! 2 2, Keen and Kavanagh! Inspired substitution, may I, may I say. Um, Kian Kavanagh, Madden with it played it into Dren and Dren whipped it in. Roger saved it out and it just came to Kavanagh who stuck it in. 2 2. And we're right back. Oh, and okay, we're having another chance here. And it's in! We've won it! Liam Cow. Oh, she, we were on overload. <laughs> I forgot to drop back, but yeah, it worked out. Liam Kelly's given us the lead here. And it looks like we've won this cup final. Amazing turnaround. Kelly had the shot. Drennan played it to Fahey. Fahey, great header through to Kelly. And Kelly's shot squeezed through the legs of Roger. And it looks like we've pulled off the most unlikely of victories. And we have. We've won the cup. Our first cup win. Two goals in two minutes. I'll say passionately. I'm happy with your performance out there. Enjoy the success. And yeah, most of them look extremely delighted. Fantastic performance, especially in those last two minutes. Oh, I can't believe we won that in normal time. I was, I was preparing for extra time, but yeah, fantastic. I'm not complaining. And Podrick Amon gets the golden boot as well. So yeah, we've won the cup. <laughs> awesome. Uh, Trump Rovers fans will be celebrating tonight. Uh, nice. yeah. It's pretty much the second thing. It's pretty much a good way to go if you're going to skip through them, <laughs> which I often do. I should just send an assistant, but then they're like, oh, your media, your KG towards the media. Anyway, yeah, we got given 12k for that. That's not bad. That's, our finances are in pretty dire straits, so I'm not going to lie. Um, yeah. <laughs> and they're going down. There's not really much I can do about it. Um, I've utilised the loan market, so we wouldn't have to pay that many wages. But on some of them, we do. Uh, on Robbie Crawford's, we had to pay a loan fee, which was annoying. But, yeah, I didn't. And I, I don't think we could survive without some of the, and if we if we cut down the squad even more, I don't think we could um, do as well as we have been. But yeah, so we've won the cup. Um, fantastic result. 
and yeah, first first competition that we could have won, we have won. Um, which is yeah, really good. Uh, we'll be looking to probably finish second in the league. I doubt we'll catch St. Patrick's and Fletcher. They've already secured Europa League football, which I think is top three. Um, so yeah, they're not they're not going to be caught. I doubt even by me. So yeah, if Sligo can't ca catch them, it's only going to be a matter of time before we can't catch them. So yeah, we'll be looking at second place. We've got that game in hand on Dundalk. Um, so we're essentially two points behind them. And yeah, hopefully we'll win that. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, the amazing cup win. Uh, if you liked it, give it a like. If you have any questions, comment. And if you want to see more, definitely hit that subscribe button. I've been the FM Gaffer, and I'll see you guys next time.